So today I'm going to show you a carrot and butternut squash soup, um, mostly because those are just some leftover veg I've got in the fridge. I've got 800 grams of carrots here and 800 grams of butternut squash, which is peeled, all peeled, and I've just cut up roughly. Um, and it's going to be a dairy-free, gluten-free, everything-free soup, so hopefully everyone can have it. And um, I'm going to show you firstly which one of the best tricks that I've ever been shown with a Magi mix, which includes these two bits. Um, and basically, it slices all the veg for you, which is just the best thing ever. Magi mixes all come with lots of amazingly useful attachments, which often don't get used enough. Here I'm attaching the disc support and the grater disc to finely cut all of the veg for my soup. So here I'm grating two onions, four cloves of garlic, 800 grams of carrots and 800 grams of squash, which I've already peeled and chopped a little bit. So I've just heated four tablespoons of oil over a medium heat and I'm gonna add in all the shredded veg and sweat this all off for about 10 minutes over a low to medium heat. Next go in the spices, ground coriander, chili powder and ground cumin and I'm adding a large heaped teaspoon of each. Mix through the spices and leave for a minute before adding a liter of stock. I'm using gluten-free veg stock, but you can use chicken if you prefer. Bring to the boil and then turn the heat down low and leave to simmer for an hour or so until the veg is soft. Take the veg off the heat and add 800 milliliters of coconut milk. Now grab your hand blender and blend the soup until smooth. Just like this. Lastly, to season the soup. You don't want to season too early as flavors become more concentrated the longer you cook your soup. So we always season right at the end. Return to the heat and heat through before serving. To plate, I've heated a little bit of coconut milk and used the hand blender to froth and then chop some coriander too. And serve with some delicious bread, butter, and maybe a bit of cheese too.